Intelligence is a world leader in real-time personalization technology using next-generation machine learning algorithms to generate custom user experiences from any shop or website when a user arrives on the site. Uh, we're using the big data which is available on the web that everybody gets a unique site which is just tailored for you when you arrive on the site. And uh, nobody else is doing that. Every, today every site is looking super static and all looks the same, it doesn't matter who is coming to the site. So we take that uh, new topics like social media and the big data trend in uh, to account and take things like the product craft, which is in the end the product on e-commerce shop, the social craft, which are your friends on Facebook, and the interest craft, which is in the end what you search for. If you put together all three things and using that data and correlating it, and then you can generate uh, custom and tailored user experiences just on the fly. The trick is all just to do it in a real time and in a millisecond. And uh, that wasn't possible before and that's where we are really unique and um, what intelligence is going for. And in the future the, the internet will become super personalized and uh, I think these old pages are soon totally outdated. Uh, using the same site for everybody, it, it's not working all the, in, in automotive, not everybody's driving the same car. Even if you go from A to B, why should it be on the internet? I think Innovator can also be seen in different dimensions. On the one hand, you have this innovation in the small part, where you just see how to optimize a small process at home or on your way to work or at work. Uh, that is the same kind of innovation you have uh, even as on a high scale. If you have in this think in this super big dimension, sure you can change the world with one innovation and have this new kind of electric car coming on the market and disrupting the whole automotive industry. Sure that is an innovation and the innovator takes the risk and execute that. But I think everybody can do that um, in some kind of creative way. Um, it's more that we have to foster these people to take the risk and also tell their opinion on what they would like to innovate. So imagine you're at the train station looking for the next train, you are at the airport looking for the gate, and today you always have to search for, wait for the result, ask people. But if the internet can become your personal friend or your assistant and helping you with your daily life and making life much easier for you, this definitely would help everybody. And in general, the, you can improve the state of the world of taking all that information and uh, become like a digital curator where we do not push you all the information, but you get just uh, information uh, you need for just your situation now. And uh, this definitely makes a life, your life a bit easier as the information, uh, amount of information uh, just explodes at the moment. And uh, you can see especially older generations having already problems with that. Uh, I think the personalization is definitely the approach you go for in that direction.